Curious about the new CCNA exam format? Hi, I'm Ronnie Wong, educator here at IT Pro TV, and I've just finished taking the exam itself, and I wanted to give us an update on that. So as you get ready for the exam, you do need to know about a few things that will help you out in your studies. One, there's 102 questions on the exam that you are going to end up facing, and they are a bit challenging. And they're challenging because of a couple of different reasons. One, there's multiple choice uh, types of questions. Two, there are also multiple answer types of questions. And then there are also drag and drops. Now, the one thing that is curiously missing is the idea of simulations or simlets. Now, I'm saying that right now, but remember that the exam iteration can change, but as of right now, it is not, and there is not simulations on the current edition of the exam. Now, when we start doing that, the minimum score is an 825. Now, out of 102 questions, that's a pretty high number of exam or questions that you have to get right. Now, that doesn't necessarily mean it's easy. I actually found the exam itself quite tricky in that sense. So make sure you study these topics well that you will actually have to download the exam blueprint and to make sure that you actually take some time, go over those areas that are actually truly weaker for you. Now, to help you out, don't forget that IT Pro TV's library itself has a new CCNA uh, course in it that you can watch that will also help prepare you for the exam too. Now, along with this, there's also, of course, a complete track for CCNP, but for the exam update on CCNA, that should help you to get started. Make sure you actually check out our library for more details. And be sure to subscribe to the IT Pro TV channel. I'm Ronnie Wong, and thank you for watching this critical update.